every time you feel that you want to have a strong connection with God, angels, spirits, you are going in that place. It's going to be become your favorite place. I also see that uh, in, you are going to have a great idea. Maybe you are going to see different things and you are going to have a great idea. There is a trip. In this trip, you are going to help somebody. You are going to have a very uh, strong spiritual moment. You are going to have an idea about something that uh, you, once you come back to your place, will start. Maybe you are going to a restaurant, maybe you are going to a shopping, maybe to a, you are going to a store, a bookstore. Something is going to call your attention and you are going to think, wow, this is so cool, I'm going to do. And then you come back to your place and you start practicing whatever idea you had. <laughs> it's going to be a great idea, my dear. Porque, because once you start something very creative, a new idea, it could be something that you are going to sell or maybe you are going to, uh, it's a service. Maybe you are a teacher, a doctor, maybe you are a spiritual counselor, maybe you are a painter, maybe you do nail, maybe you work uh, as a hairdresser, I don't know. But when you bring the idea to your location and you start practicing it, there will be a huge amount of people very curious and they are going to buy whatever you sell. They, they want what you are selling. If you are selling a product or a service, I don't know. But it's something, you know, it, that's how universe works. If you have faith, if you connect with God, and you see a purpose in your life, from night to day, you can become a billionaire. Just by finding out your purpose of life and have this spiritual connection. You get in a very high level of your spiritual evolution. You start working, use your creativity, Use your light, your soul, your heart, and suddenly you become a billionaire. That's how universe gives back gratitude for whatever you are doing in this spiritual connection. And Spirit Guides is asking me to tell you, if you like to play lottery games, to, to get a card and play the number that is butterfly. If you look at Google, or uh, I, I have a book as well. I have a book, and in this book, there are spiritual messages from number one to number 100. And also, there are animals' numbers. A butterfly has a specific number. I don't remember now. But if you don't want to buy the book, you go la and you Google butterfly number. And there will be a series of number that belongs to butterfly, blue, butterf blue butterfly. And you are going to play those numbers and you're going to get a prize. Yes, this is true. You know, it already happened to me. I was walking in the street. I was taking my dog for a walk. And there was a huge beautiful butterfly, blue butterfly. And this butterfly took me to a place that was a lady selling uh, prize cards, you know. Uh, and I pay, I, buy, I bought a card with the number of a butterfly. I don't remember if it was the number of a butterfly or she, because we here in Brazil, we have a, a game that, um, we call animal game, okay? So you buy, I bought butterfly and I got, I got a prize. It wasn't, you know, billions, but it was a very nice prize. 
And I came back and gave a very good quantity for that lady that gave me luck. That's how we do here in universe. The hands that gives is the hands that receives. And now what I see here is that uh, you are going to be a mother, a father. You are going to become a mother. You are going to become a father or a grandmother or a grandfather. And also I see that if you are in a relationship, I don't see, I don't see things very good in a relationship. There is going to be an argument. And um, spirits are telling you to be patient and to be calm. Because all these arguments, it's because there is a witchcraft into your house. Okay? A witchcraft into your house. Somebody took something from your partner or from you or anything from the house. You know, sometimes people get go to visit us in our house and they take something. Oh, this is stone is for you, okay? Oh, this is for you. This is stone is for you. And then you put the stone there and the stone has a spell on it. Spirit guide is telling me somebody took a piece of underwear, a piece of something that belong, uh, belongs to you, a hairbrush, a toothbrush, and took to a place that they do witchcraft. It put a spell on you. That's why you might have a lot of arguments, discussions with your partner. All you have to do is a spiritual cleaning in your house and open Psalm 91. Open your Bible, Psalm 91, pray it, protect your house, protect your marriage and for those who are single what i see for those who are single is that there is somebody there is somebody very special about to get into your life and this special person is someone that you are not expecting not looking for and this person comes like a wind and this person is going to fall in love with you. This person wants to marry you. It, like you meet this person today, tomorrow this person wants to live with you. They are going to admire you. They are going to fall in love with you. They are going to take care of you. You are going to be like, what? Because you are not used to people taking care of you. You are the one that is always taking care of people. So you don't know how to deal with it. And God wants you to learn how to accept love. This is beautiful. The energy that I'm feeling. This is the most beautiful thing that a father, a holy father can wish for their children. You are God's favorite child. And God wants you to learn how to receive love. Thank you, spirituality. Thank you, you. If you like my readings, please subscribe. Give me a like, share. If you want a private reading, the subscriber has a very huge sale discount. Thank you.